Hi, Dick Rochford here in uh, 2004 Meridian. We're leaving uh, Niagara on our way to Laconia. And here's the big picture. Contact Cleveland Center on the one one eight point six two. ATC has been telling us extreme precipitation at 12 o'clock. Twenty miles, so we've made a, a turn to the left. We initially deviated to the right, to come through here. And I know it sounds like I'm using this as a tactical tool. I am not. I'm not picking my way with NEXRAD. We are using a far better tool called color weather radar. The 40 mile range is best on, particularly on the older units that don't have the same resolution displays. And so the method is to paint ground or what you think is ground so that you're not overshooting any weather that you might get into. And then uh, put the uh, bearing pointer where you're traveling. In this case, we have a crab that's about 15 degrees to the right. I'm going to adjust this to 15 right. And then turn on the view, the, the alternate view, which is the profile view, and look for asymmetry in the paint top to bottom. And seeing none, we're, we're confident that this is okay. Look out the window, and here at 270, we're still in the clouds. Well, we had uh, uh, trace the light in the climb. Um, our equipment's still on, of course, because we're still in, in the presence of visible moisture, plus 10, minus 20. Also minus. So we're happy with this right now. In, in a minute, we'll probably just go on direct Syracuse. Uh, so why don't we uh, why don't we make that happen? So we'll go direct, enter, enter, switch to nav, and see what happens. Literally, first thing we want to do is go back to the radar, switch back to the horizontal view, and decide on what the crab angle is going to be. It's probably going to be about the same. When I say crab, I'm talking about the antenna, the radar antenna is pointing at the lubber line, and we're actually flying uh, 5, 10, 15 feet to the right still. So we'll just keep that cover, or that uh, bearing pointer 15 right, switch the view, and you know, with a little experience, you don't have to switch the view so often. Uh, just verify the paint is symmetrical top to bottom, like a Rorschach ink blot. Just fold it in the middle, mentally, and there you have it. So now we're using Nexrad and uh, Datalink Lightning as the strategic tool. We're using radar and storm scope as a tactical tool. And the Mark anybody? 1 eyeballs are kaput today because we're still in the clouds at 270. This Dick Rochford flies safely. Train off it.